What up guys, Mad Viking here. There's been more firings, more stuff is leaked out. Some of this I knew last night, but it was only three names at the time, and I didn't think I needed to jump on the ball and make another video. But um, it seems now NXT has taken the sword, or fallen on their sword now. Um, before I jump into it, you've been hearing me say in these videos more firings are coming they're coming um smackdown is waiting now because they haven't had any cuts yet raw 205 live nxt have, have had cuts smackdown's been spared which we know isn't the truth they're going to get cuts too um it's predicted that there's going to be hundreds of firings but now granted it's not all talent on air talent it's backstage and staff and Whatnot. I mean, um, they're supposed to have been 20 people fired alone from their social media department and WWE headquarters. Um, Spanish announcer Jerry Soto has announced he's been cut. Uh, writer Andrea Listenberger, she's, her latest storyline was Mandy Rose and uh, Otis. She's been fired. Um, word is that some of the bigger name wrestlers that were released are receiving... Uh, payoffs the NXT talent I don't know if this goes for everybody else is supposedly getting 30 days of pay and then after that they're free to go and do whatever they want um, I will get into coaches first NXT coaches PC staff coaches Ace Steel Serena Deeb Kendo Cashin and this one's got me a little upset Cash Ono hasn't been declared fired but he has been removed from roster to the alumni section. He is a coach and wrestler. He wrestles primarily right now in NXT UK. Uh, it wouldn't shock me if they let him go. They fired him. I don't know. This will probably be his fourth time being fired. Maybe fifth. Um, so, yeah, he might be gone. Cash is on. Oh, why would he be moved to the alumni section during these times of firings if he hasn't been fired? So, yeah, he's probably on the uh, trash heap, too. That's another guy, though, who's tight with the AEW crew. He could certainly bounce back and have great matches. So anyways, the NXT cuts so far as have, as, uh, as follows. Top of the list, biggest name is Donna Parazio. Uh, I don't think she'll suffer any. She'll just go back to Ring of Honor. Her boyfriend, fiance, Marty Skrull, runs the joint now. She'll be fine. MJ Jenkins... Fired. Dorian Mack. Fired. Uh, he was just in the Outlanders group with, um, oh, geez, Riddick Moss. I mean, they were getting over, but I guess I was only getting over in house shows. I don't really see him on NXT TV. I thought he had some potential. Big dude. That's for you. If those because his name has been changed like 20 times. He was one of the guys in the original, what is it, the greatest Royal Rumble ever in Saudi Arabia. Big, big, huge, bald, white guy. Alexander Jackzig is fired. Uh, he's in the last few of my recent NXT house show videos. He's the dude that kind of looks like a girl. Uh, in the last Tampa show that I went to, he was wearing women's clothing with some other dude who wears earrings and stuff. He's fired. He was very new to the company. So I guess he was not uh, getting over. Uh, that's all I got for today. I just did a sweep before I got online just now to see if anybody else had been fired. But those are NXT cuts. Like I said, SmackDown is for sure coming up next with firings. They're not going to be spared. Um, I'm shocked some other names weren't let go here on NXT like I said, Aaliyah, Vanessa Bourne, uh, Ornery Loken, I could name a few, but there's a lot of Performance Center people who've been in the Performance Center for a long time and haven't seen the light of day. Uh, I know they did a lot of international signings in the last year. If you watch my Dade City in Tampa house shows from months ago, they had a lot of those people on those shows. Uh, and a lot of them I didn't see a damn thing in, but they're not on here. They're not listed. But I mean, like I said, Aaliyah and Vanessa Bourne, they are NXT originals, and they have still yet to have been called up or 
really even seen significant TV time. Um, speculation with SmackDown, I could see a lot of people going. Uh, I think Cesaro would be one of them. Uh, isn't Sheamus there now? He's back, I think. He's there. I mean, you would shake your head at some of these names, but I mean, these are people WWE is just holding on to to hold on to them. That's it. They have no plans of pushing these people. So when the SmackDown axe falls, I will let you guys know, but that was uh, NXT cuts, staff cuts, and coaches that I know of since yesterday. Uh, I will keep my eye out and let you know, like I said, for SmackDown's hammer to fall. So that is it for now, guys. One more time, Donna Perazio, MJ Jenkins, Dorian Mack, Isaiah Williams, who is a ring of announcer. Uh, I don't know that he gets TV time on NXT TV. Uh, if you want to know who he is, watch the last few of my... Well, I don't think I ever record him. So I was going to say watch the last few of my NXT house videos. Um, I'm shocked there's not a few announcers on here because they have way too many announcers. But whatever, that's just me. So that is it, guys. That is today's current firings. Uh... Like I said, more are coming. Expect more. Hold your breath. I, uh, that is it for now. Mad Viking out. Catch you in the next one.